didn't like this family event. To be honest, I prefer going to the restaurant and doing grocery shopping or something you can do in a room with air conditioning like joint Toastmasters <laughs> meeting. Just imagine if my family wants to go hiking. That means I have to wake up earlier than usual. The most importantly, it's so exhausted, especially when you are on the unlimited uphills. All you want to do is crying for help. And I could still remember how many times I really cry out loud, not that out loud. <coughs> Just wish my parents to do me a favor. Gradually, I realize there are numerous benefits of hiking. Nowadays, it's me to say, let's go hiking to my family and friends. There are numerous benefits of hiking. The first one is it can increase your sense of happiness. The research has found that hiking in the most extreme cases of high risk suicide patients, hiking led to a drastic decrease in the sense of hopeless. From my experience, when I was backpacking in Europe, I planned to go hiking by myself. At first, I thought there would be many hikers with me. However, there was no one there, zero. I was worried, what if I got lost? What if I got injured? No one will find out. No one will help me. And I might not have second chance to go back to Taiwan. And maybe I need to get married there? <laughs> no, I don't want it. What a nightmare. I don't want it. After consideration, I made up my mind to do it anyway. Alone, there was no one on the way. I was astonished by the view when I finally reached the summit. And I could still remember how happy I was at that time. So I'm telling you, hiking can really make you happier. What's more, hiking can reduce our tension, depression, and anxiety. The research from Stanford University has found that even a 90 minute walk in a natural environment can have a significant effect on the brain and the way we feel. They ask participants to fill in questionnaire about negative thoughts and conduct a brain scan before they finishing a walk in, the, in an urban or nature environment. After that, they ask those participants to fill in the questionnaire and take a brain scan again. The result, people who had walked in a nature environment showed a significant reduction in negative thoughts. And from my point of view, whenever I'm sad, depressed, or stressful, I would like to go hiking and unplug myself. Although it's a little bit exhausted, I will feel much better and energetic once again. So believe me, hiking can really make you easier and more comfortable. Hiking can also improve our overall health. It helps to improve our fitness, build muscle and lose weight. The statistics has found that people who take exercise like hiking are half as likely to suffer from heart disease like as people who doesn't exercise. And hiking is also good for our eyesight. Nowadays, people spend so much time on TV, computers, and smartphones like some of you just did. <laughs> uh. And hiking is really able to lower the pressure in your eyes. 
So, let me once again, hiking can really improve our overall health. When I was young, I went hiking with my family and I really enjoyed the memories we created together. Time after time, I gradually realized there are numerous benefits of hiking. Hiking can make me happier, reduce my depression, anxiety, and tension. Hiking can also improve my overall health. And I want to tell you hiking is really a nice exercise because you only need to prepare for is comfortable clothes and the shoes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think we are very, very lucky because in Taipei, there are different kinds of hiking trails. You can even download the app to help you explore the beauty in Taipei. So you can become happier and healthier. So today's weather is so nice. What are you waiting for? Let's go hiking! Toastmaster all day. <laughs> <laughs>